Let's go in the direction of Gibraltar. I'm probably gonna not go to Port Royal, but St. Kitts itself. It's dead, I should say. Do the treasure map I have? Uh, that's gonna be east of San Juan. I don't want to meet and fuck anyone, okay? <laughs> I appreciate the opportunities for advance, but, but I'm kind of locked in the idea of maybe, you know, heading off in this direction. Very slowly, courtesy of the wind. What? Thanks. Thanks. It's not like I wanted to fucking stop in Rio or anything. Thank you. I did want to stop off here. Let's risk it. Oh, whatever. I was almost going to turn into that. too far away. I'm gonna have to risk another salvo being fired at me. There we go. That still might be too far. If you hit shore too far away from the fort, uh, it's not good enough. Basically, like, it's a retreat. Oh, God. <laughs> Okay. We have some wiggle room, some time and opportunity, but I'm gonna need you to register my blocks that I do. Or I'm gonna need him to not block. What are the two? Back up. Okay. Oh, time for me to go on the pain train. Understood. Nope. This is... Cannot back up anymore. Get out of my face! Carbon copy of me? Thank you. <laughs> Most of their gold may have been hidden away, but not the silver trade. Yeah, if I'm, uh... I'm actually going to go all the way up there. We're going to take some, uh, take some goods with us. Left for Maracaibo a few months ago. Hmm. Hmm. It's a good thing I stopped in. That means that he went from Gibraltar to Rio de la Hacha. And then bounced to Maracaibo. This fucking video game. <laughs> I mean, there was value in me stopping there. See if I could uh, cut Carmen San Diego off at the uh, at the pass. Land ho. We did not. So, we skipped a step of going to Gibraltar by going to Rio de la Hacha instead. And that still wasn't good enough. <laughs> no. Fuck you. We're gonna find some other Spaniard who maybe knows where my dad's located. England captured Caracas? No shit! Really? All right. Means I got a friendly port down here that's not too far from Kumana. On the one hand, I do want that treasure up there on the... I mean... St. Kitts is going to be a better fort for me to sell all this, uh, 
Or better locale for me to sell all this sugar, anyway. Where's 50, though? How much crew do I have? Okay, I can't lay. I cannot be getting into fights. I really wanted my goods here. Get that. I'm gonna fill the rest with food. I, I don't expect to be fighting any. I'm actually doing a little bit of the uh, the wheeling and dealing here. Just something that you could do with, say, more ships. We got a. Uh, just got the two. One of them's damaged. Could be a value for me to stop off at a friendly port, if nothing else, to get the ship repaired. But I don't want to go more eastward in, uh, you know, this video game courtesy of The Wind. Sail ho! Imagine being a slave to wind, chat room. I say, doing a local recording. <laughs> nah, no, nah, let's, nah, let's not hold down the, uh, the speed up, okay? Let's just... Take everything at its pace. I definitely don't want to fight a larger ship with 28 crew. I wonder how much I could staff given the expedition time and uh, how much gold we got. You might be uh, spoiled by the uh, the mechanic in the uh, the PC version from the odds, like, if I have just a thousand gold per person, but they could be unhappy, but they'll never mutiny. It's not quite how this game works. I figure if I have a crew in the 80s, uh, they'll be unhappy. But I'm pretty sure with uh, what I've got, I could uh, support uh, a crew in the 60s. I mean, I gotta take advantage of the wind. But I definitely wanted to go get that treasure. And, you know, St. Kitts is further north, so... You know. I'm gonna come up here and then the wind will be very firmly in my face and uh, we'll wreck the bark and I'll lose a lot of treasure. 7,000. Worth the price of 500. Really, you could just turn this game for me into, like, one scavenger hunt. Here's, like, the pieces of 50 treasure maps. <laughs> Have fun. <laughs> Fuck this whole family ship. Griffith isn't finding the family like a scavenger hunt? Anyway, yeah, but then they give just give you another map piece. Now, that one is 100,000 gold. That does pay off. Still. Land ho. All right. What's uh what's prices of sugar like here? All right. Not too bad. I will now accept my promotion. I am now a colonel with 550 acres of land. Duke in La Hoya in Santa Marta. I see. Make some pleasant conversation. Twelve dudes? Yeah, we can definitely support twelve dudes. Spain's now at war with Holland. Hmm. Alan hasn't given me amnesty. And I do intend to beat up more Spaniards anyway, so... Oh, something I'm considering is uh, bouncing over to Nevis, recruiting more soldiers, and uh, maybe depending on prices, coming back to St. Kitts and uh, selling stuff, maybe recruit some more soldiers, and then uh, striking down south. After I get the boat repaired. We'll keep the cannons. I think with that idea in mind, I am going to save the game. 
And yeah. Have I only made one cartridge save? Huh. And the reasoning behind that is if I end up recruiting into unhappiness, uh, they're going to desert me and take a huge chunk of treasure with them, and I'm just not going to accept that outcome. Just, just hard pass on that one. I will absolutely, like, load out of that hell. Thanks. That doesn't sound fun. Pop in, see the governor while we're here. Urgent mission. Deliver this to your cousin in Antigua. Alright, a ransom of 2,000 gold pieces? Sure. Howdy. So... The governor's daughters are rated in different qualities. Uh, they are the folks that you marry. Uh, this image, although it can be color different, as can the others, is uh, regarded as the highest quality of governor's daughter. Makes a pleasant conversation. Were I to have wit and charm, uh, we could uh, woo the various daughters uh, with lower rank. Making pleasant conversation uh, while well, having sufficient status can uh, turn a daughter into an informant that can tell you about the location of the silver train and the treasure fleet uh, anytime you stop by and see the governor. Marriage is for points. So if you're, if you're into scoring... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Antigua is pretty close by. Yeah? Yeah, it's pretty close by. I think we'll try to rely on future Grimmiff to ferret that information away. And uh, see about uh, turning that one in before I uh, head to Nevis again. Trusting future Grimmoth, though, is always a dangerous proposition. How we looking, guys? Happy. It's 76. Good. We just made a bunch of sugar money. And I presume that fucking helped. Huh? Yeah. Alright. I think I'm gonna start attacking French vessels. Uh, along the way. But we are going to leave Dutch vessels alone. I guess I don't enjoy the idea of having safe harbors with the French, but, uh... We're making our choices. Land -ho. Right, two forts. Wind, please. Yeah. That doesn't mean I have to piss them off with, you know, an attack on a fucking penis, right? Just keep our eyes out for opportunity. No, I don't want to go that way. Thank you, though. I appreciate the offer. Very kind of you. Crew is only pleased now instead of happy. Expedition length. Really weighs into their souls. Mm hmm. Land ho! Let's go. Oh, God. Okay, you could just not register that as a hit, I understand. Woo! This character. What the hell is this attack speed? Or rather, total lack of attack speed. <laughs> okay, there we go. Let's get some attacks in. Had to fucking put some binge on the joints, I guess. Eleven thousand two hundred and fifty gold from that. 
They did not hide any of their gold. Oh boy. That was, uh, that was pretty good. That was pretty damn good. We got a lot of sugar, if I were to just go back up north again. And now the crew is happier because, you know, suffered some losses. 290,000. I don't want the crew to be unhappy whenever I leave port, because they will, uh, they will desert and just take an unreasonable jug of wealth, really. Like, how dare they? The jerks. Trinidad? Ow. Maybe. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. 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 Why don't we invest in some stock? <laughs> and goods, I should say. I had I had money on my mind. Corporate Grimoth there, alive and well. <laughs> Here's the thing though, I'm thinking if I go to Trinidad that I'm just gonna be flung to some other place. He probably isn't there, but he could be there, you know? He could be. He could be. Uh, I'm gonna end this video early. Coming back. Uh the English took Caracas. Curious. And uh, we continue to balance the ebbs and flows of everything forever without having a divvying up the plunder. We're, uh, we're not doing the worst. Huh? Huh?